Hi, I'm Bobby Hemel, Principal Broker at Select Realty in Mena, Arkansas, and I'd like to help you understand the process once you get an accepted offer. The first thing you need to do is choose your lender if you haven't already and complete your application process. Get them all the papers they need so that you can get moving on that process. Your, at that point, your Realtor will send your completed contract to your lender. The next step would be that you order a home inspector to come out and inspect your home. I highly recommend that you get a home inspection so that you know what you're buying. You want to know every plug-in that works and doesn't work. You know, even um, they check the roof, they check under the house. You really want to make sure that you get this process done. In an inspection though, you're finding out what you what is wrong with the house, if anything. And then you have a chance to negotiate that out. Um, if there's a lot of repairs, you can ask for the repairs or you can ask for a reduction in your price, but be aware that the homeowner at the time may decide, well, I've reduced my price this much, so I'm not willing to do any repairs. So that's where your realtor comes in and you negotiate that point, that part out. Even though you have an accepted contract at an accepted price, you still have the opportunity to, opportunity to work that out. But be aware, there's normally a time that you can do this. Usually it's around 10 days and that should be in your contract. The next thing is your, your um, lender will order your appraisal, the value of your home, of, of the value at the time. That usually goes on what has sold in the last three to six months with a like property in your area that you're buying the house. Once that comes in, then your lender and your realtor will order title work. But one more thing you have to do, write this down, you have to look for your homeowner's insurance. Usually you only have five days in which to get that done once you have an accepted contract. Why do you need to do that in advance? Because it may affect your loan process. So it's very important to get that part done and not all insurance companies are the same, just like not all title companies are the same and not all real estate agents are the same. So you wanna make sure you shop around. Title work, you get to choose what title agency that you want to use. And so you want to ask your Realtor what your choices are, maybe their recommendations, and then make sure you choose the title company you want as well. They also are not all the same price and they do not always cover the same amount of things. And there's options that you can choose in regular title insurance or enhanced title insurance. Those are very important. And again, you wanna discuss that with your Realtor and the title companies. Once you've made that choice, your lender and your realtor will send all the appropriate documents to these companies or to the company you choose. Once that's completed, they check and make sure that there is no liens against the title and what process needs to be done so that your um, property can be insured, your title work can be insured through the title company. A very important process. So those are the things that need to be done. So again, let's review. What do you need to be doing once the contract is completed? Make sure your lender application is complete. Make sure you order a home inspection and make sure you shop for homeowner's insurance. So that's three things that you are responsible for. The things that will, your lender will be doing is ordering the appraisal and ordering title work. The things your realtor will be doing is sending your, your contract to your lender, to the title company, and helping you negotiate out any repairs or any price changes from your inspection. That is a very important process so you don't spend more money than you have to and that you are getting the best possible deal. At that point, if their repairs are more than what you thought they should be, then you also have an opportunity to walk away from that. There's also the term termite policy that you are going to negotiate out um, during your process of your contract. And that time, your um, the listing agent or 
your agent should order that termite inspection and policy. That also, if there's a policy on it, that also can be transferred to you, another part of the negotiation process. So I hope that this answers some of your questions. The last thing that happens once the appraisal's done, inspections are done, your insurance is done, your, uh, and the title work is done, at that point, you get to review all your documents and then you close. Make sure that you review your documents before going to closing. A good realtor will send those documents to you in advance, making sure that you have time to review it before you go to closing. So when you get to closing, there's no surprises. That's in a very important process. And again, not all real estate agents are the same, not all title companies are the same, and not all inspectors are the same. So it's very important that you take the time to go through this process in choosing the right ones. Good luck in your home buying process. Again, here at Select Realty in Mena, Arkansas, we would love to help you through that process. Have a great day.